Are these the best Bluetooth headphones on the market? Let's find out. Oh, <laughs> Dave Taylor here, and I am listening to the Biodynamic Amaron wireless headphones. That's these, and they're big, but you know what? Holy cow, they have amazing audio reproduction quality. These sound fantastic. Now, if you're familiar with Biodynamic, you already know that they have the Amaron Wired, which is basically these headphones without the Bluetooth circuitry. Now, turns out these come with the wire that make them wired. We'll get back to that in a minute but they've added all this nice Bluetooth technology and it works really amazingly well. These sound so nice. Now, let's get some specs out of the way. The frequency response is five hertz to 40,000 hertz with a 32 ohm impedance if you use the wire. If you're using Bluetooth, obviously that's not hugely relevant. Um, sound pressure level 100 decibel, one. Um, actually, total harmonic distortions less than 0.05% at 500 hertz. And it's using Bluetooth 4.2 and has built-in support for APTX, APTX LL, APTX HD, AAC and SBC. This is a lot of acronyms. What it means is these work super well with the iPhone family, that's AAC, and with most of the good modern Android phones which are gonna have APTX, like this Huawei that I'm using here. So APTX, you know, AAC, all of that just gives you that much more dynamic range, that much better quality sound, and these just sound so good. It's not the thumping, annoying bass of cheaper headphones. It's really, everything's crystal clear. There's just a definition to the music with these that are just fantastic. I was letting someone else audition them just yesterday, and he looked at me after a while and he said, how much are these? I think I might go and buy a pair. They're that good. Um, <laughs> then I told him how much they were and he said well I might need to think about that we'll come back to the price but the specs are amazing the battery life 30 hours of typical listening that is a lot of battery life and part of that is just because they're big so that you can put a big battery in here however I will say there is no noise canceling so these are over ear and they're very comfortable but there's no active noise canceling so if you're looking for something that really isolates you for their music then these are the kind of headphones I always think work better in a quiet environment and you just get that much more sound stage and fidelity and audio it's just everything's rich and you close your eyes you're listening to the orchestra and you can pick out where different instruments are sitting that is a remarkable experience if you're used to something at the lower end now comes with some neat things too comes with a hard shell case which is a little bit smaller than some of the other ones i've seen still kind of big and it comes with a usb-c charging cable and this is important because it charges via usb-c so you will need to have a different cable it comes with one but you're just going to have to get into the hang of that and let's see what else is on the controls there's a very simple um, power on and off button. And what's cool is all the actual controls when you're in Bluetooth mode are because the right earpiece actually is a touch sensitive membrane. So you wanna get louder, up. You want it softer, down. Next track, previous track, pause. And you can push and hold and then it'll actually engage Siri or Cortana or whatever it is you have on your phone. It'll be ready for it to actually interact with. Very, very nice. Now, like I said, it also comes with a wire. So if the battery dies or you just would prefer to use it as a wired headphone, in which case you could buy the Amaron wired, but let's say you want both features, is it does come with a wire that includes, as you can see in this close up, a little three button inline controller, pretty typical stuff, uh, but really nice option. And what I like also is that the wire is actually pretty modest. This is an easy thing to have zipped into a pocket of your computer bag. So you have these and these work great. And just in case they're dying and you need to charge them or for some reason you don't wanna use Bluetooth, then you have this option. So very nice. All of that obviously fits neatly into this 
hard case if you're so inclined. And really the only thing else to talk about is the price. Again, before we get there, I want to say the sound quality is splendid. Really, really, these have rocketed up to being my favorite headphones in terms of sheer audio quality. And we listen to a lot of headphones here. Now, before I tell you the price though, if I can ask you to go ahead and click on that subscribe button. Really appreciate that. And if you find this video useful and informative, give me a thumbs up. Appreciate that too. Cool. Now, the price. The Buyer Dynamic Amaron Wireless, just hitting the market spring 2018, is going to cost you $699 at buyerdynamic.com. Over time, I imagine they will show up at other outlets, and I would do a little comparison shopping, but if you want to be first on the block and have all your neighbors listen and say, wow, these make my headphones sound pretty amateur level, then you want to check out these Buyer Dynamic Amaron Wireless. This is Dave Taylor. I'm going back to my music and I will catch you <laughs> in my next video.